Hey what's up guys and welcome back to a brand new video on my channel today. Today we have episode number 3 of our Cardiff City career mode on FIFA 19. Today's episode is going to be a shorter one than normal because obviously um, I've got some, you know I'm pretty busy at the moment with starting my new job like I said in the previous episode. So trying to play and record games and edit and upload is very hard for me because you know, it, it, it's it's a lot of energy and time which I don't really have at the moment since I'm obviously getting into a routine of starting off my new uh, life in a sense. But um, yeah, we we start off with a conceding a very very nice goal from Muto there. What a turn and bicycle kick that was! Uh, it was a really really nice goal. I can't believe he actually like attempted that there. Um, but anyway, before we move on into the uh, highlights. If you could drop a like on the video, that would be much appreciated. Let's go for 10 likes like we normally do in every video, uh, which we have been hitting recently on quite a lot of our videos, which is really, really good. Uh, also, comment down below if you enjoyed the video. Let me know your thoughts on the video as well. And also, let me know if you want me to sign any more players in this uh, series, uh, which, because obviously, episode 3. I'll leave this video up for a few days before I start making episode 3 because transfer deadline day is the next day on the career mode as I'm talking right now so we could potentially bring in some more transfers but as you've seen there uh, we did go 2-0 down uh, again Muto, Muto scores again we make a nice cross in there we tried the bicycle kick but it doesn't actually uh, pay off there. Junior Hoylet's running down the wing here. Yeah, it cuts inside, uh, sends Yedlin the other way. Really, really nice fainted cross. Glided over the back line, and uh, Narsing is there to get his first goal of the season, I do believe, uh, which was a really, really nice header back across the goal, lobbing the keeper in the 51st minute. Really, really nice goal. Um, yeah, so that, that we pulled one back in this game uh, at home against Newcastle. Uh, we get another chance here with... Um, uh, Lang, uh, Mendes Lang uh, running down the wing, cuts the side, lovely shot, I thought it was going in the top corner but unfortunately it kind of drifted wide and hit the post so uh, we didn't. We were unlucky there, we get another um, go here with the uh, right back and Mendes Lang uh, linking up, Harry Hart edge of the box, it was going in the bottom corner, really really nice save from the Newcastle goalie there. Uh, we get a corner again, uh, Bamba I think that was, uh, no Origi, Origi sorry, really really nice header but unfortunately just wide of the goal. Origi picks up the ball here, really nice ball down to Mendes Lang, again contributing but unfortunately he, the defender blocks it and it goes wide. We get a corner again, this is the Bamba head I was talking about uh, which I thought was before. It bounces so high which is so unfortunate because it could have probably gone in in the bottom corner but uh, unfortunately that is all she wrote we unfortunately pick up a 2-1 loss but we move straight into this game against Huddersfield away from home uh, in our nice uh, green or sl I guess it's a luminous kit you could say but right off the kickoff uh, they make a really nice play from their, one of their attackers there uh, I I, was that Radaman or something uh, he takes a really nice shot again he gets the ball back unfortunate and then this shot it, it kind of like nearly went in. I don't know how that was, how that nearly went in. It kind of like curves so much. Uh, but anyway, we do end up conceding just six or so minutes before half time. Really nice ball in. Uh, really nice header. Uh, we couldn't really do much from uh, uh, Munier there. Um, yeah, it, it was a great header. I, I, uh, it's really frustrating watching that back because it does look like the defender could have maybe turned around and uh, headed it away. But just before the second half, I mean, yeah, just before the first half ends, we get a chance here with Origi. He gets taken out by the centre-back there, and I think maybe a few of you might know what is coming, and that is a red card. As you can see there, he gets sent off the centre-back, number five. I can't see his name right there. Uh, oh, I don't know what that was. Anyway, we've got a free kick with Hoylet. Uh, we did the tactic. We just lay it off to Hoylet. Hoyle, I was going to shoot, but then he does a really nice touch, takes it past all of the defenders there, whips a nice ball back across, and um, I don't know how this has gone in. I tried to head it back across the goal where that defender is on the post, but Patterson, our right back, does head it into the keeper, and he bounces off him and uh, actually ends up in the bottom corner, which, yeah, we you could say we got lucky, um, but I will take that any day of the week. A goal before half time and a red card uh, for the other team, which uh, helps us increase our chances of winning, but... We went 2-1 down. I don't know what the defence was doing there. We were very, very like far back 
away from the striker there and uh, he bags his second of the game just uh, well not even 10 minutes into the half there um, but we do get a kick off obviously and we uh, push on Patterson drills down inside cuts it across the Narsing Narsing to Loftus-Cheek he uh, cuts inside plays it to Origi misses the shot but Narsing does get the rebound with a really really nice goal there that's two goals and two games for Narsing there uh, really really nice composed finish because normally when I get that, like say like a rebound happens and you get an open goal, it either P rolls or just balloons over the crossbar. So I took my time as I press circle in there and we uh, end up getting a goal. Narsing plays a nice ball over to uh, Tomlin there, our cam who came on. And uh, Reed who also came on plays a nice ball across the goal. He gets the ball back and we got so lucky there with this goal. Really, really lucky that Reed actually ended up scoring that goal because... Uh, the keeper, I don't know what the keeper was thinking there. The keeper's completely like soft dive and he's just, oh, I don't get it. But anyway, Harry Arter plays the ball into, uh, I think that was our centre mid or Loftus Cheek. I think it was a centre mid. But anyway, Reed gets the chance after tackling the defender. He completely misses it. He should be scoring from there. Nearly in the six yard box and he misses that. Uh, 91st minute, what a save from our keeper, the young keeper we signed uh, in the previous episode. Really, really good save to save us from keeping all three points. Now, as you can see here, we're moving in into a cup game in the Carabao Cup against Aston Villa. Uh, I had to make quite a few changes due to the fact that obviously we just had a game against uh, Huddersfield, and um, yeah, we uh, we had a, quite a lot of unfit players. But obviously, it's a cup game, so I wanted to give um, our rotational players and younger players uh, run out. So. Uh, Decore, our centre back, the young centre back we signed from Mujugnab back, is getting a start, his first game of the season. Uh, we're also giving him Mendes Lang a start after his, after his impressive few games, and also Bobby Reed gets a start as well. He's played uh, very well in the games he has come on for us so far this season. So we now move into the uh, first half and the kickoff. We do, in fact, get the kickoff. And um, I kind of, obviously, like in my previous episodes of Career Mode, uh, in FIFA 19, whether that's Cardiff or Juventus, I had to keep the first minute because look, you show look instantly, I get a chance, and Murphy completely skied it. Uh, really, really bad shot, but it is good to see that, um, or good to show you guys that I uh, do create chances like straight from kickoff and stuff like that. But as you can see here, Kodja, really nice header into the top corner from uh, a ball in from Balassi. 17th minute, and uh, we're already 1 0 down to Villa, which is very, very concerning. Uh, yeah not really much to say about that uh, we do pick up the ball here with Murphy plays it inside to Reed. Reed across to Mendes Lang he uh, doesn't really know what to do with it plays it into Tomlin Tomlin back to Mendes Lang he cuts it back and drills in that top corner look at that the net was shaken straight back out of the goal really really nice goal from him he's really impressing me so far uh, this season coming off the bench for most of the games because obviously Narsing the new signings is starting the games uh, but really really nice finish there Murphy cuts in size and then cuts back out, uh, cuts back in again, uh, plays a nice ball into uh, Rawls and then cuts it across. Mendes Lang can't finish it, gets blocked, but Reed does get a chance, but unfortunately he uh, just about puts it over the bar. We get a corner here, uh, nothing happening there. It comes out to our centre-back, Brown, the youngster. He drives on in, he went for a shot and he's, he's ballooned over the crossbar, but I thought I'd leave that in because it was actually not a bad chance um, created, even though it did end up going over the crossbar. But uh, Abraham here picks up the ball, he plays inside the Grealish, Grealish into Balassi, plays it into Abraham. And he whips it in to the back post and Adama. Adama has just scored in the 88th minute to basically see us off uh, in the what second round of the Carabao Cup. So unfortunately guys, we're at the cup already which is annoying because it would have been nice to try and push on for a piece of silverware this season. But that's not going to happen after this loss. So that is the end of the video guys. Sorry it's a short one. I will bring out more content soon. Like the video, comment, subscribe and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.